yeah, what's up, what's up, what's up, what's up? This is your main man from the Flux Strategy Factory, bringing it to you again the way I used to do. You know, my video now is based on uh, answering some questions of some of my followers. You know, and if you're the type walking around, checking on YouTube for solution, well, don't forget to subscribe and push the like button. Okay, and push the notification bell. So you'll be notified whenever I make a video. You'll be the first person to come and watch. Now, this video is based on what someone asked me a few days ago. Okay, where they said. Uh, he said, bro, I say, yo. He said, how, how do you trade um, the high and low of the day? He said, um, because he doesn't like to wait long time to be waiting for signal this and that he said he needs he needs some you know he needs some box and i mean he needs to be constantly trading all right all right now i'm going to answer your question because i got what you're saying i know what you mean you want to make the dough i understand now the way to do that is that you're going to be you're going to be trading on a daily basis okay and the first thing I want to make clear here is that it is not about the um, this, the indicators or the high and low or the Bollinger Band or whatever. It is first thing to know about the movement of the market, the price, before it ever will move. You know, this gives you the kind of um, high power to make some bucks in the market on a daily basis. Now, let's start. Let, let's go get some kind of um a moving average and we're gonna make a moving average 20 period okay 20 period of a moving average okay this is good for this day day time uh every day trading stuff you understand good and then i want to show you something i want to show you something so fast all right you see what you're going to be looking at on in this type of situation here is that you focus your attention on the white moving average 20 it has gone down all right it has gone down this is the white heavy 20 gone down so as it's gone down definitely your attention is going to be going up so you want to go focus your attention on maybe how to buy you understand great but i want you to know that in between the down it's going there's always a buy sell happening in between buy sell like you can see me touching them buy sell happening now for you to make the box on a daily basis this buy sell is what you want to focus regardless of the movement of you know of the ma white 20. okay now let's go again to do something here let's do something here look ma white 20 has gone up with the buy, 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 buy. Now, what is going to be happening right here is that M A twenty has gone up. M A twenty will start coming down, and that is what it's trying to do right here. And as you can see, there was something happening here: sell, buy, sell. Okay, buy, sell, buy. Okay, and I think there's a kind of little bit of sell happening right here okay but then what is going to be your own um your own uh wait let me zoom this thing a little bit so we can see it properly right okay when you see a kind of um m a 20 white m a 20 as point up to this level you want to think of okay um there will be some buy sell you'll be picking it but how will you know what is going to give you the alert when you're set up your little bit of setup to come make your dough on a daily basis has happened now this is where you need a kind of something like that can give you a kind of alert okay you want to you want to get something that looks like a kind of a um, support resistance indicator support resistance indicator that can give you a lot okay okay let's put it it's 20 20 period support resistance indicator okay i know most of you watching this video you don't have it okay this is it okay this is it you don't have this support resistance indicator which i put here it is the blue color here okay support resistance period of 20 
now it will be giving you a lot you see the price inside the support resistance when price is hitting this low it will give a lot and we gotta buy okay and when we buy we understand that yes we buy but it is gonna buy and go to create the next um resistance so as we bought we're gonna close it when it has created the next resistance and when it create the next resistance we're gonna sell it okay sell it until it will go and hit the next support okay i know it's not easy to explain with just ordinary mouth like the way i'm talking it okay except you have you've seen it how it works how it plays okay that is what i do so i'm talking about it exactly the way it works all right now and then there's a link i will put under this video okay this link this link will take you to this support resistance to where I, I put it there i put it there for you if you need it you can get it okay you can get it there it's very important because uh, every strategy is going to work if you have the right tool okay but the first thing is when you know exactly how the market and what the market is doing what i want to explain to you here is that this ma5 has created the longest leg okay now it has created a pattern that looks like this a pattern that looks like this then the next thing it will do is to create the longest leg going down the longest leg going down but then it will be touching on a daily basis it will be touching resistance to create the resistance of a new day that is where you want to sell look at there was a resistance here of previous day if you sell this you get out of here okay because there was a little buy that happened here and finish it here the buy happened here and finish on the resistance of this day now let's say you sold here from the resistance of this day um and you know it's going to support now boom you are in profit boom it's greatest support of this day now creating support of this day hmm, you bought it you know that okay it is going to create the um resistance of another new day which it is trying to do right now any last move now we bring this one to finalize the uh, resistance of this day after the resistance of this day is created boom hmm? it will sell you will sell it then it is coming to create the um, support of today which will break this current support can you see the way i'm talking about the the movement of the price before it will ever happen all right okay so i say it's not because of your indicator or it's not because of your uh, uh i low strategy or bollinger band or this and that it's about your awareness first of all of how the market moves now look the longest leg to the up has been created by this ma20 boom gone up oscillating buy sell buy sell buy sell oscillation now it has created a kind of pattern this pattern now because i know that the expectation is to create what to create the longest leg which finalize you know which finalize a kind of um m m shape boom coming down all right maybe coming down to you have to know which level is it coming coming down to this level the previous level is broke or this level where the book out where the breakout happened sorry i forgot about how to speak that english where the breakout happened it's coming here it's coming here or it's coming here where the breakout happened it's coming here the longest leg will end right here let me put something the longest leg will end around here 
as you can see that I'm in the trade and this is my TP this is my take profit level just above the end zone of this uh, longest leg all right so because I know that the longest leg is going to be created and it's going to end here. So the idea of everyday trading is you want to see that price has touched the uh, resistance and you want to sell it. Okay? You exit at the support. This day now, because of everyday trading, now I am waiting. What am I waiting for? If I bought here yesterday, I want the price to touch the um, uh, support or uh, the resistance of today, then I will close my buy, okay? But I, I don't have a buy, okay? I don't have a buy because I know the longest leg is going to get here. So I should follow the longest leg by selling, all right? So once I hear my alert that the price is touching the, uh, the resistance of today, I'm going to pop in another sell. You can see I have some sell going on right i have some sell going on i have pending sell here okay as you can see so when the price now touch the resistance of today okay i will now put in my sell okay and i will i will hold it and get out today when it break this current support then I will repeat the same thing over and over again until until the price get to this level, which shows that this this longest leg. Well, by the time it comes down here, it's complete. The price will be ready to turn around and start going to the up direction again, repeating repeating this process right here. So, if you were a little bit confused about the way I've explained it, what you just need to do is, regardless of the movement of the white MA20, okay, just follow the buy and sell as price touches the support and resistance. But you have to know exactly that where you're going to take your profit. Where you're going to take your profit is the most important okay when it's hitting that uh, when it's hitting that support because this this one is going down okay when it's hitting that support if you bought it maybe by mistake or whatever you have not done the wrong thing you are still correct because it's, the price will always pull back it has to pull back to the moving average 20. it's what it's doing right here you see it it's a pullback Okay, as you can see what is going on here, it's a pullback, even though the, 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 the trend is going down, but there's a pullback. So if you understand how the market moves, you can get out from this zone. In my case, that I stay here in Japan, I say, okay, maybe last night, last night this was happening, then I bought. I said, okay, I will close it in Asian time. I will close it in Asian time, because Asian time, the, uh, the Japan market opened. So I'm going to close this type of thing and I'm going to sell because they will sell. So I want to sell with them because this trend is going down. The sell has a big power. And when will I sell? I didn't just want to wake up and jump into the market, but I just want to see this resistance. I want to see the resistance of today. So from the resistance of today, I sell it. Hmm? By the time it breaks this support, I get out and the trade will end right here. This is how to trade on a daily basis. This is how to make your box on a daily basis. Okay. <clears throat> it is not about the indicator. It is about you, your awareness of how to see exactly what is happening. But if you apply this um, principle of the moving average 20 and the support resistance period 20, this too will guide you into banking your profit. It doesn't matter how the MA is moving because there will be buy, sell, buy, sell, 
happening on and on and on and on and on.